Did you know that 1 in 60 children is diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder, short ASD? Children with ASD show deficits in social communication and interaction with a broad range of symptoms. Those symptoms are due to malfunctions of the nervous system caused mostly by genetic mutations. The list of mutated genes associated with ASD is long. However, almost all of the disorder mechanisms are fully understood. Currently, there is no medication available. The vast spectrum of symptoms that cause ASD lead to serious delays in the diagnosis of children. To find new approaches for the diagnosis and the treatment of ASD, we look at the basic components of the nervous system in ASD patients, their brain cells. Since we can't have direct access to the brain cells of the patients, we take a little detour and start from the patient's blood cells. We utilize recently developed methods to reprogram patient-specific blood cells into pluripotent stem cells. These stem cells regain their ability to develop into any cell type of the human body, including brain cells. These cells are a simplified version of the patient's brain and allow us to take a closer look. First, we examine the morphology of the cells. With a fluorescent microscope, we look at how the brain cells grow and form connections with each other. Second, we analyze brain cell communication. We culture brain cells on chips with thousands of electrodes to measure their activity. And third, we study how the expression of genes in brain cell cultures differs between patients and their healthy siblings. With this detailed information about cellular disorder models from many ASD patients, we want to build a comprehensive database which in the future will allow us to develop novel therapeutics and diagnostics for patients with autism spectrum disorder.